It's crucial to know what you have in a place in order to manage the land so we can be sure that the generations to come can still see what the original San Francisco was like. When you think about the wildlife of the Presidio, you have to think of the Presidio as a whole because the habitats for wildlife are everywhere. The creeks are habitat for an entourage of animals that need water and cover. And our forests are habitat for a whole different type of wildlife. And even our lawns at Fort Scott are habitat because the great blue herons and the coyotes actually go down and catch the gophers out of the lawn. Even our buildings can be habitats for wildlife and children can see this type of interaction between predator and prey for the first time in an area while they're playing a baseball game. So one of the goals of the Natural Resources Program is to try to conserve whatever species diversity and richness and the different habitats that exist in the Presidio now. The important thing is to get that baseline inventory of where these different species are in the landscapes. So now we know we have more than 500 wildlife species and more than 300 native plant species because we've done these inventories. Then monitoring is a totally different thing. We take a fragment of what's going on either with a species or with an ecosystem. You need to monitor it through time so that you can see if you're gaining or losing. And if the hopes that you had for the restorations that you're doing, the improvements of habitats, you can see if it's doing what you want it to do, which is having greater diversity of species, greater number of animals. Unless we had this inventory and monitoring program, we would have never known how many different types of species there are here. <laughs>